What is going on everybody? Big Red here. Thank you all for tuning in to my Red Talk. Uh, off the rip, I'm going to apologize. It is absolutely torrential downpouring out here. And hopefully this isn't too hard to hear. So just in case it is, I'll keep it short and sweet for today. But today is Friday. It is March 23rd. March 23rd. Uh, I'm sorry, it is Saturday. It is not Friday. Friday was yesterday. But today's March 23rd. Um, as I've been telling you guys, I went to the Fall Out Boy concert last night in Madison Square Garden. And let me tell you, those boys still got it. Those, they, they still got it, man. It was like 2008 all over again. I was about it. Uh, we sat all we sat all the way up on like the bar stool seats on the on the top ring uh, of the garden. Awesome seats, great view, room to like stand up and walk around if we wanted to, uh, which was good. But they they crushed it, and they played like I want to say they played like 30 songs. They played a lot of songs. I was very surprised. But it was, uh, it was good. It was a good time. Uh, you know, it wasn't a crazy, like, late night either. Um, I haven't been much of a late night guy recently. When I say late night, I mean, like, doing stuff past midnight, unless it's work-related, honestly. But, uh, caught, like, a midnight train coming home you know it takes a while to get my you know mine's like the last stop on the line so it takes a little while to get there but you know got home 130 ish I would say maybe yeah you know and then obviously couldn't fall asleep because I was so jacked up because I just saw fall out boy and body wakes me up bright and early 7 a.m. no matter what so that's a nice fun little perk of getting old, you know, it's like clockwork, no matter what, it doesn't matter what time I go to bed, wake up at the same fucking time, same time. But today it is absolutely dumping rain outside. This is awful and don't know. Hopefully it's not not gonna last very long because I really what I really hope is that this is like the the last like big rainstorm before you know spring is in full swing. Which I think it might be. I have a pretty good feeling about that. Um said something we're supposed to do. It's like flood warnings all over the place. I don't know. We'll see. We'll just wait and see what happens. But, you know, I kind of hope it's the last big rainstorm before spring and then the weather really turns and it gets nice and we just, like, you know, make that turn for the best. I saw something on Instagram the other day. It said that, like, I think we're, like, two weeks away from the sun setting after 8 o'clock at night. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. That's, that's, that shit we do like. So. But, yeah, that's, uh, you know, last night was... Last night was a lot of fun. It was my first time taking the train in and out of the city in quite a few years. And let me tell you, it's quite the experience now. Um, those of you that don't know, the main train station in the city is Penn Station. And Penn Station is like... It's like they tried to, you know, they did a lot of work to it, and it does, it looks decently nice, so I'll give them that. It's a lot of, like, new stores, and, 
you know, they made the ceiling higher, so like it looks a lot bigger, and you know, so I'll give I'll give them that. They did a did a pretty good job with that, but it's just like it's still a cesspool, man. It's like you know, people just sitting and laying on the floor, like walking around, like it's not. And it's like you're just like on edge the entire time you're in there because you see all this shit going on. It's like you don't know what the hell is going to happen. But it's, yeah, it was, it's bad. Definitely bad. So, hopefully it, they fix it up. Probably not because New York City is a shithole. All things a mess. The city's a mess. Penn Station was disgusting. I'm very happy that I only had to go upstairs at MSG and not anywhere else. But they need to figure it out. They need to fix something. They need to it needs to it needs to be done. They want to keep like the prestige that New York City has. And to be honest. I think it's completely lost at this point, but that's just my opinion. What the hell do I know? You know, they need to, they need to fix it up. They need to clean it out, clean out all the shit in there, and get this, get it back to its glory. We'll see. We'll see what they do. Um, I highly doubt they'll do anything, but you know, whatever. So yeah, that's my uh, that's my thoughts on New York City. You know, I was never really a big fan of the city anyway. Like people were going to the city, like I never wanted to go. Still don't want to go. I, one, I don't like taking the train. I think taking the train is, I mean, it's convenient, don't get me wrong, but I'm just not a fan of, like, having to go someplace and, like, not being able to leave on my terms, if that makes sense. So, like, you know, if I'm going, I don't know, going anywhere to do something in the city, you know, like, I'd rather drive because I feel... By driving, I'm able to, you know, nice car accident. You know, if I drive, I can leave when I want to leave. That's kind of how I, it's kind of how I roll with that. So <coughs> that's my my thoughts on that. You know, the train being super convenient. It's like you're stuck to a schedule that it runs and. Something happens. It's like you gotta wait for a train to fix, or you gotta, you know, pay five hundred dollars for an Uber to take you home out of the city. So, yeah, I was never really a big fan of the city. I was never, you know, I never like have the urge to go out in the city. I never had the urge to work in the city. You know, everybody's like, oh, we live so close to the city, you can just take the train in and out and do this. We live on the second most populated island in the world. I'm like, you don't think there's jobs out here? Plenty of jobs. That's me. I don't know. Drop a comment down below if you feel the same way I do about the city. You know? I'm just not into it. That's all. I've never been into it. Um, yeah, other than that, I don't really have much else. I'm, Pretty freaking tired today. I will say that. It's out late, I'm up early. It's usually never a good combination. Add that on top of it's pouring rain outside. And that makes you tired anyway. So 
that's all I got for today. Hope everybody has a good weekend. I hope it's not this rainy by you. Um, but yeah, go out, enjoy your Saturday. Please make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, turn on the post notifications, all that good jazz. And I will see you tomorrow. Peace! We're still going.